travel with My attitude so jacked that I loaded a rapper with it I can't be stopped, I'm a juggernaut anarchist I can't look back with looking forward to greatness Hit so hard, I changed the name of the game Nothing come close, no one ever the same Legend the make can't fight like a brain Showing no boss while I'm setting the pace I'm gonna show you how a queen become a legend Hey folks, what's up? Hope you're loading good. Welcome to another video. In today's video, we are going to have a look at a new brand, MG. MG stands for Morris Garage. And we are going to have a look at the MG HS 2022 model. So before we start, let me tell you something about HS. HS was launched four years ago in 2018. And this is the 2022 model. And we are going to have a look at it. It is a compact crossover SUV from MG. So without wasting any more time, let's start with our review. So, let's start with the key. As you can see, this is your key. This is your lock button, your unlock button, and this is your boot release. By the way, you get electric tailgate opening, so we are going to check it out. Starting with the front profile, you can see the front profile of the car looks so good. Okay, first we we'll start with the headlamps. You can see the headlamps, they get LED uh, DRLs, daytime running LEDs, and white projector headlamp. Below that you get your fog lamps which are yellow halogen and around your uh, fog lamps there is chrome okay and then yeah you get towing hook over here and if you talk about a grill you get a very nice grill you get the MG signature grill and a big and beautiful MG logo in the center of the grill and the grill is also surrounded by chrome and now when your DRL double ups as indicator it looks like this wow it looks so gorgeous man i just love the styling of the headlamps the headlamps itself attracts so much wow and yeah this is your hood and moving towards your side profile this is the side profile of your car so if you look at the wheels uh, the wheel are quite good design i like the wheel design also and yeah you don't get in diamond cut you get grey coloured finished alloy wheels which gives a very classy look to the car and you can see red brake calipers and MG logo in the centre of the wheel well the tyre size is 18 inches but if you talk about the wheel size it is 235.50R18 so yeah quite good wheels and yeah okay, going towards this your rear view mirror you get nice LED indicators and below that you get your camera because you get 360 degree parking camera and you get it on the side and yeah one more place is it it is below the uh, logo you have the front parking camera side park camera and your door handle is black colored but this top part is finished in gray color sorry not gray chrome color and uh, yeah you get clear entry your window line is also finished in chrome you can see this part is finished in chrome and Below over here also you get nice chrome, so there's lots of use of chrome on this car. And now before we move towards the side, I mean before we move towards the rear, let's check out the dimensions of the car. So the length of the car is 4574 millimeter, and if you talk about the width of the car, the width of the car is 1876 millimeter, and the height of the car is 1685 millimeter. The wheelbase is. 2720 millimeter and your ground clearance is 174 millimeter and yeah your curb weight is between 1500 to 1800 uh, no not 1800 1700 kgs so between 1500 to 1700 kg is your curb weight now moving towards your rear wow man just look at the tail lamps they look so stylish wow look at your indicators you get led swap indicators and the way they light up looks quite good quite stylish and LED tail lights as well and when your headlight uh, your indicators are off your tail lights look like this and below your tail lights you get rear fog lamps also and this is your reverse light I believe and this is your parking sensor rear parking sensor below that you have your exhaust pipe which is also finished in chrome and skid plate which gives a very bold look to the car and yeah hs batching all-wheel drive it says because the car is all-wheel drive in all-wheel drive what happens 
the engine power is generated to all the four wheels where in normal whereas in normal uh, front wheel drive cars the power is generated only to the front wheels you get hs badging 30t is this uh, the engine and mg logo in the center you get wiper high mounted stop lamp shock fin antenna gray colored roof rails which are not functional and overall the styling of the car is just amazing now one one interesting feature in the rear is electric tailgate opening so it's very easy to open the boot because you just have to press a button and the boot opens so very interesting and if you talk about the boot space of the car the boot space of the car is 463 liters and you get a white light over here the boot light is in white colored wow and you get this partial tray which is removable so you can slide it like this and remove it also and you can even get it back so this was it for the boot now for closing the boot there are two ways either you just pull it like this or there is a button with which you can close it and the speed is also quite good it closes in no time and if you were wondering where is your fuel lid the fuel is the fuel lid is on the left side and if you are seeing this trophy badging uh, meanwhile trophy means that it is the premium version of hs that's why you get the trophy badging and yeah and there is some feature list over here which you can pause the video and check because i don't want to waste much time in this okay so yeah now without wasting any more time let's get into the rear of the car so this is your rear seat this is your rear door first of all let's check out on the rear door this is your rear door it looks so good wow you get a maroon color interior not black not beige but maroon color interior wow something different only mg has done super well done mg wow and if you see this maroon color it looks quite good premium leather has been used the soft touch over here soft touch over here soft touch over here oh my god and you can see that you get ambient lighting also and this ambient lighting in night time looks so damn cool so damn awesome you won't believe me man and you get speaker you get a 1 liter bottle holder and this is your window switch also you see it's so premium wow and you get one touch up and down so one touch up and down and if you check your rear seat man it looks so good you get three adjustable headrests at the rear you get an armrest in which you get cup holders and you get some storage compartment over here so yes it's very interesting the rear seat and you get rear ac vents two charging sockets and air purifier and your grab handle and your reading lamp so this is all in the rear and yeah one more thing as you uh, move towards your rear seat you can observe this mg welcome plate which looks super duper awesome with that said let's move towards the front so this is the front door of the car you see let's just close this window so you get one touch up and down in the front door also and if you see the switches they look so premium and this is for your uh, rear view mirror adjustment and this is for your windows control this is for your lock and unlock you can lock and unlock the car from there and these are your door handles they are finished in grey and again you get lots of soft touch on the door the only the bottle can easily fit over here speaker is there softer softer soft touch wow you get hard plastic over here no this one is also soft touch okay nice and yeah you get mg welcome plate over here also and what do we get to see over here electric um adjustment for the seats so this is six way adjustable and you can also adjust the height which is amazing so you get electric adjustment for the co driver seat also but that one is four way while this one is six way so that's the difference nothing much and these are your rear uh, not rear your front driver seat which is so damn sporty man and you don't get any adjustable headrest the headrest are fixed again trophy badging on the headrest and it looks so damn good it feels like a racing car seat is put in in this car it looks quite good and let's get inside the car so i'll show you more things so as soon as we get in what do we see headlight leveler system over over placed over there and when we get in 
first thing what we see is our steering you can see the steering is so well designed and yeah you get a uh, nice controls over here for this your virtual instrument cluster this is for your entertainment system and you get a nice big mg logo in the center of the steering you get parallel shifters your wiper stocks your light stocks and cruise control oh my god you get cruise control so awesome man and you are seeing the super sport feature i know you're looking at this again and again i know it looks so damn good it looks like a racing car steering i know right but uh, this super sport actually is your one of your driving modes only so what all driving modes do you get you get standard you get efficient you get sport you get super sport and you get customized so standard is your normal mode efficient is a, such a mode where your fuel efficiency increases and your uh, sport mode is where uh, you get good amount of power to pull the car and your super sport is all the power whatever power is there in the car you're using in super sport okay and your customized feature the customized driving mode it is like you can uh, you know customize the uh, driving settings according to your driving style yeah and you get virtual instrument cluster which looks quite good and to operate this your virtual instrument cluster this is the switch so you can see you have lots of settings you have settings over here okay you can access it like this from here lots and lots of features are there inside this so this is here uh, this is your speedometer over here this is your tachometer and in the center is your mid but this is all digital wow it looks so good and now coming towards your center console wow 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 it looks so good if you see this your ac vents which are on the side those are circular and in the center they are flat and you know stylish but if you see that uh, your entertainment screen okay so first talking about that it is your 10.1 inch touch screen system and yeah it has got android auto it has got apple carplay it has got bluetooth connectivity and lot and lot of features so if you uh, see some features if you go in car and all you have lots of features such as driving assistance comfort and convenience driving and maintenance factory setting lots and lots of features are there and below that you have your ac controls you get dual uh, climate zone you get yeah you get dual climate zone and these are your controls for the ac this one so if i act if i press this the ac will get activated so you can uh, you know activate your ac through the screen and then below that you have 12 volt charging socket a uh, type c charging socket and this socket is for your android auto and apple carplay you can connect it with wire yes yeah, so this is closed and now this is your transmission your gearbox so talking about your transmission you get six speed automatic dual clutch transmission dct and yeah you get nice mg logo in the center of the uh, gearbox and yeah you get park reverse neutral drive sport and manual mode and talking about over here you get your hazard light switch this is your modes modes like your driving modes you have standard efficient um sport super sport customized as i said before this is a 360 degree parking camera this is a very interesting feature and very helpful feature when you are parking somewhere where there's a tight parking spot like cars in the front of you side of you <laughs> rear of you everywhere and you have to park over there then this feature is quite helpful so you can see you get two modes 2d and 3d so in 2d mode this is your front mode side right side rear and left side okay and if you go in 3d 3 is very interesting you can see everything around the car what all is happening so this is quite interesting i love the 3d mode it looks quite good and if you see your dashboard and all it's, it has soft touch soft touch over here soft touch over here and where will you get to see hard plastics over here below okay so yeah this is a 360 degree parking camera this one is your boot release you can release your boot with this button this is your start stop function how does it work for example if you st uh, stop at a signal and you know you stop at signal and you want to uh, like you you want to save fuel so the car will automatically off and then uh, it will save fuel and as soon as you press the accelerator the car will on automatically and this is your differential lock button okay this is your electric parking brake you get auto hold function and this is your hill descent control how does auto hold function work check it in one of my short video it is going to come very soon 
or it might have already come okay this is your cup holders and this is uh, your phone holder here is your armrest you have quite good storage inside and with integrated in this is your um, air purifier so that's a quite good feature and now let's check out your vanity mirror you have a mirror with white light same as the case over your mirror white light and your this is your reading lamps leds white light again and if you want to on them together you have this switch this is your sunglass holder and now the most interesting and exciting part in this card is the panoramic sunroof so first let's open the sunroof and show you this is how it opens sun blind sun blind and the sunroof together it opens one more touch it should go back okay no it doesn't go back and now to close it you push it forward like this and it closes and if you have noticed the roof in this car is in black color whereas a normal car it is beige color yeah so it is in black color and the seats are in maroon color to give a sporty look you know and to access this sun blind sun blind it is over here this button if i press it like this it goes back and to uh, you know put it back you press it again front like this and it is coming back so this is a quite interesting feature sunroof i know most of you love the sunroof only most of the time in all the cars right okay here is your glove box you have a white light set up in your glove box and glove box glove box space is also very nice and you get your auto dimming rear view mirror also over here so that's also quite good okay so talking about some safety features um what all you get in safety features is uh, you know anti lock braking system electric brake distributor a uh, stability control system then ess and six airbags lane change assist 360 parking camera uh, rear parking sensors blind spot monitor lots and lots of features you get in safety features and yeah most important 5 on 5 star rating by euro and cap test wow this is just awesome by mg well done yeah and that and with that said uh we will end this video oh wait 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 i haven't showed you the ambient lighting right just look at it over here ambient lighting wow okay let's show you the color options yeah i totally forgot about it okay come on exit exit quick quick hmm okay over here when you go in car and you go in comfort and convenience you can see ambient lighting you can off it you can on it and this is your ambient lighting settings so these are your color options for example if i put it on blue if i select blue you will see it comes in blue ah uh, this color attracts me a lot huh? and if you put in red red color will come if you put in green you select green green comes if you select orange or red again okay, red comes and then you can increase and decrease the brightness as per your wish and yeah that's all for the ambient lighting or why okay yeah from from here yeah and the home screen comes back over here So that's all. Lots and lots of features are there in this car, and yeah, one more feature. This one, adjustable seat. Uh, your seat belts are height adjustable. Uh, see, features are not ending only. <laughs> okay, yeah, but it has got over now. So with that said, I have showed you each and everything about the car. Now it's time to end the video. I hope you liked the video, and if you liked it, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And before you leave, make sure to comment on how do you like the car. With that said, we will end this video. I will meet you soon next in another video very soon. So till then, bye bye. Take care. Wear seat belt and drive safe.